So this is the lock and lube G-Gun. We're getting it all fixed up. I got the grease in here, pumps from the bottom. So what the instructions say to do is you pick it up and you slam it down on hard surface to release all the air. And then you start pumping. And we're pumping. I ain't got grease yet out the end. So the way this one, uh oh, this one's had grease already. That's good. I've, I probably pumped it 20 times before I turned on the camera. It's feeling like we're fixing to have grease. Yep, there it is. So we got grease now. So that is it. That's the last time I ever have to prime this grease gun. Because all you do now is you add grease from the top. And that's all you got to do every time. I'm going to get a little rag here and clean up that little bit of grease. Y'all bear with me. Sorry. And then we'll take it over here and try it out on something. Everybody's back doing dirt this morning. All right, so we have grease already. It's got 10 foot of hose. Comes with a lock and lube grease fitting in. So that's it. I put about 10 tubes in here. I'm trying to find somewhere that's got a 55 gallon or a five gallon drum so that I can fill it up once and be done with it. So now to add grease to this, again, this is the lock and lube G gun. Cost about $269 on Amazon. It says a thousand PSI. So now it's full of grease. So I'll just add on, add on, keep it built up, keep the top on it, keep it clean. And then the lid locks the top down. That's a foot pedal to grease with. And that is it. I know this is a quick little video. Hope y'all enjoy it. Hope everybody has a wonderful and safe day. We'll see y'all in a little bit.